Hi, Cynthia. Thank you for coming out and helping us tonight. We only have, from what I can see here, Scott and Kimberly. Is that correct? That's what it looks like. Megan did just send an email about five minutes ago stating she didn't think she would be able to attend. Have we heard from Carlos? He emailed earlier in the week indicating he was out of the country and would not be able to participate. Hmm. Okay, so uh, now we have Steve uh, and who else do we have? I'm missing somebody. Oh, uh, Liz. Uh, Kim's here. Uh, oh, no, Liz here is here. So we have one, two, three, four. So we do have a quorum. Uh, Cynthia is uh, dealing with the appointments committee tonight, but she's very kindly offered to get the thing started for us. And she's going to get our guest speaker from Bay Cove uh, connected for uh, sharing her screen. Uh, it doesn't look like she has arrived yet. She did ask if it was going to start immediately. And I said, no, there'd be a few minutes just when we read out the thing. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and start. So we get that done. By the way, happy Valentine's Day to everybody. Happy Valentine's Day. Thank you. Same to you. Thank you. So uh, welcome everybody to the Human Services Committee, February 14th, 2023, 5.30 p.m. by remote participation by a Zoom link. Zoom link uh, meeting https dot, dot backslash backslash town of Barnstable hyphen us dot zoom dot us backslash j backslash 885-729-25326, meeting ID 885-7292-5326. One tap mobile, 833-548-0276, US toll free, 833-548-0282, US toll free, meeting ID 885-7292-5326. Uh, on roll call, uh, committee member Liz Reverdell. You might be muted, Liz. Uh, yeah. uh, committee member and uh, vice chair, Scott Fitzgerald. Uh, present. Committee member, Dr. Uh, Kimberly Crocker Crowder. Present. Thank you. Uh, I, Cheryl Powell, uh, Chair, am also present. I think it was just, just in case. Uh, committee member and state representative, Steve Soros. And we have also heard from committee members, uh, Carlos Barbosa and Megan Moore, that they will not be able to make it. Um, hopefully, we'll be watching for Bay Cove. They did send the slides. I forwarded this on. Um, so one of the things I did want to do while we're waiting for Diane to come on is to just go over our purview. And the purview, because I had a couple calls, just to make sure we were clear on it. Uh, we're a standing committee serving as an advisory board to the town council and town manager, presenting and promoting solutions, including implementation plans and coordinating consolidating efforts with agencies at the local, regional, and state levels where indicated. The committee will assess the health and human service needs of our community including but not limited to homelessness and the mental and physical health of the town's residents on a regular basis, but not less than once a year, the committee will report to the town council with an assessment of the town's human condition. So that's our purview. Um, and I'm just gonna check my email because Diane would have sent something she couldn't get in. She confirmed she did get the uh, link. Uh, new email, just double check. Aha. So yes, at 534. Uh, when I tried to join, it says unable since I was removed by the host. Hold on, I'm gonna go answer my phone. It's probably her. Hello. Hello. Hi, is Cheryl there? Is this Diane? I'm calling about a new solar power program for homeowners. Okay, I, I'm in a meeting right now, but you have a wonderful evening. Take care. That is not Diane. Um, That'll those phone calls. 
Yeah, I know. That'll Sorry. make the solicitation phone call. I'm going to call her. Uh, Anyone want solar panels? I had someone banging on my door earlier today trying to sell them to me. Oh. Um. Hello? Hi, Diane. We got your message. So let me see here. I made you the host so you can run the meeting per usual. Megan will not be there and Carlos will not be there. So, okay. So if I can run it. I uh, have had no training on this, so I'm happy to run it, but we need to figure out how to get you in. Um, Scott, any ideas? Yeah, let me take a look. Um, if you, Let me see. If you're the host, there should be, you should have a lobby button in which it'll give you an alert if someone's waiting to come in. Part I have no alerts. Participants? Um, yeah, I, I You, can you try to log in again and see if I can get you, if it'll let me in? Let me let show you yeah, in? I can. I, I, I think it's something, it's not just about seeing me. It's something about, like, if you if you delete, if the host deletes somebody, it's like to protect against people, you know, <laughs> cyber stalking or just jumping into meetings they're not invited to. So I think that you are unable to rejoin this meeting because you were previously removed by the host. Do you have an alternate email that the invitation? So with my account, when my account tries to get in that meeting. Uh, Cheryl, okay. Cheryl, tell, Cheryl, this is Cindy. Tell her to try a private email and I will try to send the link to her again. Try a private email and she's going to send the link to you again. You I need that? a different email than I Bay did, Cove. I did, yeah, so she can send it to, uh, let me, is she there? I can get she is, it. you can hear, can't you, Cynthia? Yes. All right, so yeah, try and send it to Concord, C-O-N-C-O-R-D, Diane, D-I-A-N-E, at Gmail. Okay, it's C-O-N-C-O-R-D, no space and then diane d-i-a-n-e at gmail.com yep all right let me try that thanks cynthia yeah sure all right and then cheryl if she cheryl if she pops up on your screen let her in oh, how do i let her in do i just say is there an option to say let her in uh, yeah, her email will come up or something will come up. That's weird. I don't understand what's going on. Let me. Um... What if she logged out and logged in again? Yeah, she can try that. Yeah. Because right, I. Things on my end, and, I'll, uh, and you try on your end, and we'll, we'll talk again in a few minutes if nothing works. Yeah, because Cheryl, Cheryl, you're co-host, so when she signs in, you can let her in. I'll sign off to make sure that I'm not the problem. Can I just make sure what will? Because uh, that's what I'm saying. I don't know how to run. If it she comes in, does it say let in or not let in? No, it her her uh, a white box pops up on either your email or the Zoom screen, and it says so and so is trying to log in, and all you hit is yes. Okay. So let me sign off your meeting and um, check in with us in a couple minutes. <laughs> okay, yeah, well, I will. Okay. Okay. So I'll keep the phone here. Well, we're going to have some excitement tonight. So I'm mon monitoring my email on one end and uh, this on the other to see if any, a white box pops up. So anyway, um, I did everyone get the write-ups that I did for all of our previous speakers? Yes. Okay, there is one more to come. I've asked for these slides that uh, housing used uh, so that we can use those. And um, it's just there were quite a few of them. I, got, I have the two that she sent as her primary, but the 
there's some others. So as soon as she sends those through, I'll send them and then there'll be a write up from tonight as well. So I know Diane. Oh, do you? Yeah, we used to we used to go to the gym together. Terrific. I just didn't realize it was Diane until I saw her name on the um on the slides and I'm like, wait a second. So yeah. Hey, excellent. Yeah. So is everyone having a good Valentine's Day? We're all wearing red. <laughs> there you go. Well, so am I actually come to think of it. I know. Let's give it a couple. Some work so far. Pardon? Mostly work so far. I'm going to go out to dinner after this meeting. So, Excellent. Yeah. So I'm just watching the screen for anything that comes up to let her in. I still have, it's, oh no, five, it says four instead of five participants, but that's because Cynthia has come off. Um, yeah, typically it's just like the little chat bubble thing that will come up. Yeah, I've seen it before, but not on this. And I figure that there's something different with the town. What I have is the mute, the stop video, the security, participants, which says four, share screen, pause, stop recording, show captions, breakout rooms, reactions, apps, more. What, I want more? No, Tim, so what'll happen is like, it, it will almost pop up and superimpose like on my screen. It typically will pop up on the top right-hand corner of the okay. primary screen. Um, I'm watching the entire screen, so. <laughs> Okay, so now it's just recording. It's got a uh, white with a red flashing uh, thing. Yeah. That's just recording. Thanks, guys, for bearing with me. So anyway, while we're waiting for Diane to come in or for Cynthia to come back, you know, what we want to do is put everything together and see if we can come up with something that kind of touches on everything. Um, Beethoven, I was really hoping to have because I wanted us to have, you know, we might be able to use the, the facility and coordination through that. Um, let's see if that's the same thing she put through before. No, it still says remove by host. That one, there's nothing new. Uh, reactions, nothing here. I'm wondering if maybe she got identified as Zoom bombing or something, but if she accidentally got lucked out or something. I don't know how long that lasts. Let me call her back. Putting on speaker, so if anyone knows a solution by what she says, do let me know. Hello. Hey, Diane, it's Cheryl. Any luck? No, nope. I keep saying the same thing. I even restarted my computer, which usually fixes everything. I'm trying it again right now, just in case something happens. Okay, I'll keep you online. No. Yeah, it still says unable to join this meeting. Maybe we should plan this for the next time we meet. I really apologize. I don't know what is happening. Uh, obviously, other people have gotten in, um, but I, I, I can't seem to do it. <laughs> uh, I'm just wondering. Let me put my thinking cap on here. Um, and Cynthia, I, I don't think you're monitoring. Is that correct? No. Okay. The so. only other thing, the only other thing that might 
work is if you look down at your at the bottom where it says participants, there's yeah. a little arrow. So when you click on the arrow on the right side of the participant box, it says invite. Oh, yeah. Yeah, and I try to I send an invite out to the email address that wasn't banned. Um, she may be able to just then click through that link to enter because an invite okay. was sent out. Excellent idea. So, or we could call out. Um, why don't we try calling out? Name to be displayed. What the only like? issue with the call out is that she then wouldn't be able to share her screen to do the presentation. Oh, that's true. Okay, so let's let's go back into that invite. It's an excellent idea. Um, because Diane, if you stay if you stay logged out of your Zoom and then you get the link and then just yes, click on the I, link. I did log out of my. Okay. So Diane, what's the other email aside from the one that we had for you? Uh, my personal one was the Concord Diane. You have the okay. It's not my name. That's not my recording. Yeah, dsansoro at bakehope.org or you have. I gave you that other. It's one. not a Gmail Bye. default email. Let's start. Okay, so if I go into invite, it gives me Yahoo Gmail in default, but it gives me email and call out. The, yeah, so so whatever but the email but the call out doesn't allow it, but the email doesn't allow me to put anything in. So no, but if you click on like default email, that will then open a blank email from whatever email you have installed on your desktop computer. Gotcha. Concord. Diane to Concord. Upper Diane. Uppercase Diane. It does it's it's not case sensitive. Okay. Concord Diane. At email. And then stay logged out of your Zoom. Don't re-log back into your Zoom because typically if you join through a link while you're logged out, you can join as a guest without being associated with a registered Zoom account. Okay. So I've got C O N C O R D D I A N E at gmail.com. Now uh, I'm gonna put a plus on that. Oh no, I'm just gonna put a send. Cannot send me message using service share. Um, try later, outgoing Verizon net. Um, okay, that's been sent. I don't have it yet. Okay, I'm going to try doubling that. There is a Gmail special one. So since you're uh, also on Gmail, secure, smart, easy to yeah, full work. No, it's just letting me log in. I don't want that. Um, okay, that's Okay, if I get locked out here because I'm trying different things and it might not let me back in because somebody will have to let me in. And, and so, Scott, as vice chair, if I get kicked out, take over, okay? Uh, even though we don't, well, actually, we don't have a. Um, if, if you get kicked we don't out, have I think quorum. the meeting shuts down. Yeah, we don't have a quorum. In which case, I will email everyone tomorrow. I'm trying with Gmail, but when I go to the Gmail, it gives me this whole help center thing. Uh, get Gmail, sign in, which I don't have a Gmail for work, and it won't let me go back. Let's see if it'll let me go out. Do, do, you think it, do you think it makes sense to try to do this like next Tuesday instead or at a time when, because I, I hate to miss a piece of the presentation or anything, you know? I, I would too. And I think it's open for next time as well. Um, I do have, I do, I'm going to have a real hard stop at 630. So I don't yeah, want I do to, too. and I okay. don't want to miss it. That's what I'm saying. I, yeah, I don't either. 
Okay, so uh, let me call Diane. Diane, are you still on? I am. Are you able to do this uh, next week? Let me check. I mean, I still have to clear it with the town that it's available, but. Yeah. Yep, I could do it on the 21st. Okay, so let me just check, make sure there's nothing here. And I take it you didn't get the Gmail that I sent either. I have not received that, no. Rats. Okay, well, it is what it is. So I apologize to you for the inconvenience, okay. but and I will contact you tomorrow uh, just to, um, and I'll let you know if that can be done. I'm gonna let you go and thank you so much. I, if it's all right with you, Hold on one moment, I just got another idea. Um, spotlight for now, it's not gonna let me do it that way either. Uh, mute, invite, I'm gonna try one more thing. Now it only goes back to the other thing. Invite, uh, invite to phone number, options, call, nope. Um, and the email won't default email. I'm try get on, Cheryl? Work. We're still trying to get her in. I don't believe it. I don't know what's going on. Um, it's still saying that she, the host is, you know, not. So we're trying. Yeah, I didn't even see her sign on, so I'm not sure who might have hit that button. Um, tell can I if, just? Can we? What we've been talking about, and I have Diane on my phone here, is uh, one of the things I wanted to mention to the committee members is maybe changing ours to take because the appointments committee has kind of come into this space which is fine uh but what about us changing to the third tuesday you mean just for this month or no if we because there's they're going to be uh in in the on the second tuesday now oh, how oh, do you feel about going to the third tuesday doesn't bother me either way what about the others fine fine with me Okay, obviously I'll send out an email to the others, but but um, just to ask uh, Miss Level, is that is that acceptable or not? Uh, that's fine with me. Yeah. Okay, so can we at least for this month, and then we'll figure out where it is. Can we can we say we'll do this at the same time next week? Diane, are you okay with that? Yep, that works for me. Everyone present okay with that? And Cynthia, are you okay with that? And the town's going to be okay with that? To do what again? I'm sorry. I was trying to work on Diane's issue here. I'm sorry. To do this uh, next next to reconvene next, next Tuesday. Uh, oh, yeah. Post this same meeting for next Tuesday. Is that acceptable? Yeah. Absolutely. I'll post it tomorrow so that we're in plenty of time for the open meeting law. Okay. I just didn't want to do anything inappropriate. No, uh, no. The town will say you can't fine. do that. <laughs> Okay, Diane, thank you so much for your patience and we'll see you next week. All right, sounds great. Thank okay. you so much. If the committee members could just stay on for a moment. And thank you, Diane. Okay. Okay. So. Uh, nobody caught what you said, uh, Cheryl. Your audio is been, gone. Up oh, there, you go. That she had already been, she had been dismissed and could not be from the, uh, and could not come back on. So no idea how that happened. That's really too bad. That was weird. Well, weird things happen. But oh yes, no, we we persevere. It'll be fine. But I'm just saying, it was great. <laughs> so if everybody's happy, we'll we'll put it on to next week and. Um, yeah, because I think we should, this is going to be a good presentation, so this way we can give it our due diligence, you know, and she's not going to feel like she just has to rush or anything. Yeah, especially since a couple people have a hard stop at 630. Right. All right, so um, in that case, I'll continue everything to next week, if that's all right, unless we wanted to go, we had the January minutes, as I did read them, is everybody okay with those, or do you want to hold yeah. those Everybody else okay with it? Actually, we can't vote on those because Kim, you weren't here in. Oh yes, yes, you were. You were here in January. No, Excellent. I was. No, you were. Yeah, I'm thinking of last year. Um, so, would okay. somebody like to make a motion that we accept those minutes? I'll motion that we accept the minutes. Your second. 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 
Uh, I, uh, Liz in favor? Yes. Yes. Scott? Yep. Kim? Yes. I was to say yes. That's one done. Okay. Um, thank you very much. Sorry for the inconvenience and we'll get it sorted and um, maybe Cynthia, I can play with you online to figure out what's gone and what went, what, what went on and try to figure out how we, how we, you know, in the future. Yeah. I, I'm going to ask IT what happened. Somehow she got blocked out and I'm not sure how that happened, but I will uh, connect with our IT department and find out what happened. Mm -hmm. I got a thing that said got it, but I always get got it when the thing start starts. So I put I yeah, did, I yeah. I don't know how she got locked out because I was at the appointments committee meeting um, that I was running, so I didn't even see her come into the waiting room. Okay, and and I didn't see her going to the waiting room either. I was looking under the participants, and I always said for, and we tried sending her an invite as well, not yeah. only on the one that she gave to you, but the Gmail as well, and that didn't seem to work. So um are we all set we, we are, are. Motion, yeah, to motion to adjourn you just need yeah yeah right, liz second, yes. second. Favor, uh liz i yep. Scott? yes I. okay uh, thank you guys see you next week okay thank you have, have a, a good, good one thanks take care thank you cynthia